topic is catatonia. Catatonia is a complex syndrome of motor abnormality presenting itself in the form of immobility and mutism. Mutism means inability to speak. Moreover, agitation, confusion and restlessness may also occur. Sometimes echolalia and echopraxia will occur with other symptoms. Echolalia means repeating the speech of another person and echopraxia means mimicking or repeating the movement of another person. In catatonia, the individual is unable to move any of their muscles voluntarily. They cannot react to what is happening around. And it's a kind of full body paralyzed or frozen or kind of body shutdown. Even though the person is unresponsive and seems unaware, they are somewhat aware of the world around them and they can also remember some of what happened. Causes of catatonia. The exact cause is unknown, but it happens more commonly in people with psychotic disorders like schizophrenia and bipolar disorders. Underlying illnesses, both neurological or medical, then brain injury or damage, certain drugs and medications, uh, these are the common causes. Then the treatment, usually treated with benzodiazepines which are used to ease anxiety. Another treatment option is ECT, uh, that is electroconvulsive therapy. It sends electrical impulses to the person's brain through an electrode placed on the head. Catatonia is a psychiatric emergency and it requires prompt recognition and treatment. If it is not treated, it leads to life-threatening problems. Another important question about catatonia is how long someone stays with catatonia. Catatonic episodes are usually considered acute, meaning they last just hours or days. But in some cases, catatonia became chronic, means lasting weeks to years. That's all about catatonia. Thank you for watching and bye-bye. See you in next video.